Oh shit. Oh, one of Rachel's mates has just texted her to say, lads are rage out getting in nowhere. We haven't thought this through at all, have we? Actually, my cousin Marcus told me about a place called Glitz. Says they always let lads in, as long as they're wearing a tie. Sounds fancy. Now then, Kev. <laughs> hey, up. <clears throat> now then, Tots TV. GCSE results night, then, is it? What is it you always say about exams and that, Tin Ed? Formal education, in its current form, is just a bourgeois institution designed to alienate and divide working-class people. What are you doing in here, anyway? Why the fuck aren't you in town grinding on some fit birdies? You know, getting your fingers wet, celebrate the end of your compulsory education and that. Well, that was a plan, but no lads are getting in nowhere. No, come out with me and Tin Ed. We'll get you in anywhere, mate. No, I'll bounce as me. A sick defo. Yeah, let's do it. So, what club are we off to? Because of Marcus told me about a place called Glitz. Nah, it's a shithole, mate. Shithole. We're going to Evan and L. Sickest nightclub in Leeds. <sighs> My sister's off there tonight. Oh, we're definitely going there, then. Right, these tennis then, boys. I'll pay for all of us, saves fucking around. Now then, Mark, you alright letting this lot in? No. No? Right, fuck off then, boys. Hey! Fuck's sake. We've still got our tenors! Fucking wankers. Fuck's sake! Well, if you can't get in heaven and hell, where the fuck are we gonna go? Here. We'd found a newsagent openly and selling a selection of Yorkshire memorabilia including these fetching ties, which, true to Marcus's word, allowed us instant, unquestioned entry to the glitz. This is amazing. Do you pack it in, checking your phone? Get in game or go home. Here you are. How many points for a slap on ass? Don't count, she's about 45. I mean, she looks younger than me. I'm off to meet some lasses. I'll come with you. They are absolutely pathetic, uh, them two. just come back from a trial for Leeds United at Ellen Road. Oi! What would Rachel say? Just get a number in cheating for the latest straight away. Do you want to wear my tie? Sure. You all right? Face all right, innit? Have you seen human traffic? There's like a, a club in that that has like two levels or three, but they all they're all different floors, but they all look out on dance floor. It's quite it's sick. I thought I... this place is alright though, isn't it? Can I get your number? No. Uh, have you... you get all like different packages and that you don't want to go half born, you've got to get gold. Right, Liam, this is Claire. We're moving in together. What? She's got two kids, but I'm ready to be a dad. Especially now I'm off to sixth form. We're off to him at half term. I need to start saving. Texting him out. Send him me love. Here, Addy. Craig is getting off with a granny over there. At least he's got a girl. I was talking to this last for an hour, yeah? I tried all things books in. I insulted the shoes. I wore these novelty glasses. I touched her on arm at least once a minute, but none of it worked. Why is none of it working? Addy and I weren't the true victims of this reductive and soulless proto-incel shit, but we certainly weren't winners either. And I was the only one back then who saw through this whole facade. You little piece of shit. Yeah, no, I went to uh, I went to Vaduka's house last week. Yeah, yeah, let me drive his Porsche and everything is sound as fuck, man. By about midnight, I'd really begun to lose the plot. What made those bastards I called friends any more deserving than me? I I'm on bench next week. Lucas Dradovic's giving me a lift. He's lying and he's got a girlfriend. Prim. And he failed his GCSEs. Well, that ain't Adolf. You mean like honesty? Amazing how quickly you can rediscover your moral compass. Me and Claire are separating. Who's Claire? The love of my life. That's all I thought. Sorry to hear that, Craggy, man. It's fine. Just I couldn't be there for Lewis and Tommy like they needed me to. Who the fuck's Lewis and Tommy? Lewis and Tommy? My boys, man. I'm gonna miss them. 
but it's over now. And that Avon holiday were killing me, to be honest. Yeah, lad. I got a number. Oh, nice one, lad. My first successful number closer. Yeah, I mean, she said she lives well north of Glasgow, but I'll probably get a car in next year, so I'll just drive up and see her. Nice one, mate. Oh, you lot, just got your GCSE results. Get the fuck out. Oh, them size were mad. <laughs>